I made this scene in Blender and I will try to break it down. The background is an HDRI from Polyhaven and is free to download. Link is in the description. The destroyed buildings and cars were scattered around the scene. They are from a collection of 3D models called Post Apocalypse from Big Medium Small. The soldier is also from that collection. The zombie woman is free and you can download the model from the website Mixamo. I also use Mixamo to create the animation of the two characters in the scene. If you want to learn how to use Mixamo to rig and animate and import models into Blender, I already made a tutorial about that. So check it out. The hand grenade is from Blender Kit and I had to connect it to first soldier's clothes and afterwards to his hand so it followed the animation of the body. The trick is to select the hand grenade and then select the rig, go to pose and then select the bone, for instance the finger bone, click Ctrl and P and select bone. The explosion was from the add-on True VDB. It was as simple as dragging and dropping the explosion into the scene. I set up several cameras in the scene with different angles. I then render them all and throw all the clips into Premiere Pro. But you could use DaVinci Resolve instead, it is free. I color graded the video before exporting it and I will share my color grading file with you in an upcoming video, so remember to subscribe to this channel. Right now I'm working on a longer scene and killing this zombie was just practice. There are still things that could be improved and Blender can be a beast to fight with when this scene gets complex. My computer started crying when I rendered out the animations. Here's a sneak peek of what I'm working on now. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below and I will try to answer as soon as possible. Happy blending!